Whenever you think of diversity, what do you think? Today, I will not be talking about typical forms. I will be talking about neurodiversity. During primary school, I was not well suited to the neurotypical environment. And everybody noticed that around the age of six, I was diagnosed with autism, dyslexia, and dysgraphia. Many people, like my teachers, doubted whether I could even enter high school or live independently without the support of my parents. But now, I'm living alone, going to university thousands of miles away from home, taking personal responsibility. My life as a neurodiverse person and as an immigrant is definitely uncertain, but I use this uncertainty as an opportunity. Wild them is used to big words. Never tire. I never tire of proving the next year's wrong. People perceive neurodiversity as a liability, but I perceive it as an asset. Neurodiversity is a vast spectrum, which is its beauty. We all need diversity in thinking and working with one another to succeed. Even though I've utilized the options presented to me, that everybody has the same opportunities. I want all of us to be more confident and open about ourselves. I don't want people to be divided by neurological differences like autism, ADHD, Tourette syndrome, dyslexia, and many others. I want all neurodiverse people to be united as a community, just like the LGBTQ community. I'm honored to work with NCLD and advocate for these important issues. I believe everybody deserves a level playing field. I'm ready and I approve this message.